The New York Islanders are proud to select from War Road High School, Brock Nelson. Okay, they went with the, the bloodlines of the Christian family, the nephew yes. of Dave Christian. Brock Nelson, who I believe is going to the University of North Dakota, which is not uncommon for kids from War Road, Minnesota. Even though it's in Minnesota, it's kind of North Dakota territory, yes, it if it is, <laughs> if you will. And that's the record. That's 11 Americans picked in this first round. So not surprised. A, a new high water mark. We had to wait a while to get our first one. It was Jack Campbell who went 11th overall to Dallas. But after that, it was an avalanche of U.S. picks as 11 went to the next 20. Brock Nelson's the big kid, hasn't filled out yet. Just over six foot three, but only 172 pounds. A late 1991 birth date. Put up good points in the Minnesota League, in the Minnesota High School League, but we'll see if that translates at the next level. I'm just glad he's going to North Dakota because again, we talk about how they develop players there. It's a tremendous institution. If you want to be a hockey player, uh, they'll help you along as well as going to school. So a lot of went there and did very, very well. That's a great moment for Brock Nelson. And with that, though, comes heartbreak for others who had hoped to go in the first round. Among them, John McFarland, who at one point a year ago, people thought might be a top 15 pick. But as soon as the selection was made, he knew that it's time to go. Let's go. Come back tomorrow. And you know what? You have to say, though, there's no shame in that. Going in the second round, you look over the years, a lot of the guys picked ahead of second rounders won't play. That kid will come back to haunt some teams. John McFarland will come back to haunt some teams. He will.